What's going on, Star Wars fans? You're watching The Collector's Hub. My name is Chris, and I'm sorry it took me so long, but we're finally getting to Star Wars Celebration Chicago. Now, me and my wife, we attended four out of the five days. We had an absolute blast. We met so many cool people, and I picked up a lot of nice things. Before we get into all this, I just want to thank everybody that came up to me. The support and all the kind words was truly unbelievable, and I loved every minute of it. I loved meeting you guys, and uh, thank you so much for that, and I hope to see you at the next celebration. So, guys, I think we're going to start off with the photo ops, then the autographs, then the merchandise, and stuff like that. Uh, this t-shirt that I'm wearing is uh, from the Celebration store. It was celebrating 20 years of The Phantom Menace, the... Artwork is truly stunning. I just had to have it and it came out amazing. So, like I said, we'll start off with the photos and then everything else. And uh, just bear with me because I'm going to be all over the place. So, me and my wife, we met Paul Bettany. Really cool guy. Dryden Voss in the house. We also met Ahmed Vest. Jaja Banks. I was really excited to meet him. Really cool dude. We met Erin Kellyman. She played Emphis Nest. Total sweetheart. Really nice person. Now for the autographs, I also met Paul Bettany. Dry and Voss. Now I really like this image. Apparently it was like an exclusive print. There was only so many on the table, so I was lucky enough to get one of these. Always love those standalone shots. Also met Greg Grumberg. Snap Wexley. Now this dude has a heart of gold. And uh, his autograph's really cool too. Really pumped that he's in episode 9. Now Kevin Thompson. He wasn't among the guests. He had his own table. And he had life-size Ewoks and stuff like that. It was really cool. If you follow me on Instagram, I posted the pictures. Um, so I was really happy just to run into him. He played Chubre, uh, the Ewok. He was also other Ewoks in the um, Ewok Adventure you know, TV movies, The Caravan of Courage and The Battle for Endor. So speaking of that, he also had these that he was signing, a wooden arrowhead. And I thought this was beyond cool. They're engraved. And uh, it actually smells like burnt wood. It's very cool. Yubnub, Kevin Thompson. And this is actually of his character from the Caravan of Courage. Uh, Chuka Truck. He was the lumberjack Ewok. You know, the one with the, um, you know, the hatchet. And he gets killed by the Glorax. Really cool. So this was a really unique piece to grab. Now this autograph poster uh, I got after the Clone Wars panel. They were giving away these posters. And I got it signed by Ashley Eckstein. So I was lucky enough to meet her right after. Because I mean this, this image is just screaming to get autographed and it looks amazing. I cannot wait for the new season. Now I got two canvas prints of Jar Jar Binks and Emphis Nest, and I got that autographed by Ahmed Best. Came out amazing. I highly recommend the canvas prints. Just looks great. His autograph is really cool. So really pumped about that. And the same with Emphis Nest. I had Erin sign it, and she really liked the idea of uh, the canvas. And what I like about, you know, again, the autographs is you, you get a lot of time to talk to them about stuff. And, you know, I was asking her about the helmet and she said that, uh, because I was like, oh, it must have been so hard to see out of the helmet. And she said that it's not just this line, it's actually the silver lens. You could actually see right through it. So her vision was perfect. So that was a, a cool little, you know, piece to know. Now, these posters, I have a Clone Wars poster and a Rogue One poster that I've been getting signed. I take, with, take it with me to all the conventions, and, you know, if the, an actor was in it or had anything to do with it, I get it signed. And it's really filling up, and it looks great. So check that out.
Dave Filoni signed the bottom, and he drew, you know, Captain Rex, Matthew Wood, Sam Witwer, D. Baker, Cat, James, Matt, Katie, Daniel Logan, Tom Kane, Ashley Eckstein. You know, so I got all those autographs in person. I mean, this thing looks amazing framed. I absolutely love that TV show. And like I said, the Rogue One poster, I also got signed by a bunch of actors and producers and stuff like that. Which this is coming out very nicely. So you have Spencer Wilding. Uh, Anthony Daniels, Paul Casey, Felicity Jones. Now this guy right here, uh, Stephen um, uh, Schiff, I believe it is. He is the producer of the new Cassie and Andor show. He was actually with John Schwartz right here. Um, they're walking the floor and I recognized John. So I went over to talk to them and he introduced me to Steve. So I got his autograph on this poster. So I'm really looking forward to that. Um, you have Alan Tudyk, Forrest Whitaker, Doug Chang. Uh, the dude's a legend. Really lucky to run into him. Uh, Riz Ahmed, Bodie Rook, um, Dodonna, Warwick Davis. Now, this is John Knoll. Um, I was beyond lucky to get his autograph and just to basically go up and say hi. So, that was really cool. Um, just, it's really filling up nicely. I don't know if I t said Paul Casey. You know, he, uh, he was two tubes in Admiral Radis. You know, so I always have them write their character name on there, too. So I, I love this poster, and again, it looks great framed. Now, I also attended the Mandalorian panel, and they were giving out this amazing poster. I'm really looking forward to this TV show. Um, you know, I love Jon Favreau, and, you know, Pedro Pascal, and just everybody that's affiliated with the show. It looks dynamite. So I was really pumped that they were giving away these posters. Super awesome. So what else do I have here? So I guess we'll get into... Yeah, we'll get into the figures. So these were the Hasbro exclusives. Um, I'll bring these close. So, like I said, the Hasbro exclusives celebrating the 20-year anniversary of The Phantom Menace. You have Obi-Wan Kenobi on the foil card. These things came out beautiful. And look at that face. Photorail face deco looks amazing. And the foil cards are so cool looking. And you also have Darth Maul. Same Dale foil card. Now there is another head right behind this label. I don't know if you could see it. It's right there. Right there. So it's cool that it has a head swap. So the good people at Hasbro actually sent me these. I was beyond pumped to re you know, receive those. Now for my big purchase, um, I got on card Gamorrean God Kenner. Now I've been slowly collecting the Kenners um, on the card. I have about 10 of them now. Uh, these things are expensive. Um, I just took them out of the acrylic case because it was too much of a glare. But I mean, this thing is beautiful. I have so much appreciation for Kenner, the vintage line. And these things are amazing. I just feel like I'm preserving, you know, a piece of history. And these things are beautiful. So I got this guy for a good deal, and I jumped all over it. I mean, that blister is nice and clear. Usually with the Gamorrean Gods, they're yellowed, and this one is pretty much perfect. So I was really pumped about that purchase. I also picked up this Ewok, because I love the Ewoks. Leak tar and nip it. Sorry for the glare. Little baby Ewok in the basket. And this cool looking warrior.
Now the vendor that I bought this from um, was giving away swag and this thing is amazing. I love Teak from the Battle for Endor and he wrote on this, he made these custom and obviously and it's the Battle for Chicago, you know, hence Celebration Chicago. I mean this uh, Eek pen, Eek Teak pin is, is pretty amazing. Um, he actually numbered these, so there was only 200 made, so it's 47 out of 200. So when I made that purchase, he was just like, you know, we're talking a little bit. You know, I was basically saying, you know, the Ewoks are awesome. And he was like, oh, dude, you'll like this. And then right when he handed over the teak pin, I was like, dude, wow, this is really incredible. So teak going strong. That was really, really cool surprise. Um, my good buddy Mark and his son hooked me up with this Jar Jar Binks pin. It was an exclusive pin, and I was really pumped about this because out of all the pins, believe it or not, um, I was I really want this one. You know, so for them to uh, just hook me up with it, I was really pumped about it. I think Jar Jar is a, a great character, and um, you know I always love them. So, Gentle Giant, I picked up the Hera Mini Bust, which this thing is amazing. The detail is gorgeous. So, there's only 750 of these made, and this is actually 483. So, I love Hera. I met uh, Vanessa Marshall a few times, and man, is she amazing. She's a total sweetheart as well. But look at that detail. I mean, Gentle Giant, they just nail it. They really do. So I'm really pumped about this bust. So yeah, that's awesome. So guys, I think that's about it. Now, I did get a lot of swag. Like, I'm talking a lot of swag. Uh, patches, pins, um, stickers, all that stuff. But there's so much of it that I would be here for like 10 minutes. But um, yeah, this is about the main the main stuff that I picked up. And I'm very pumped about everything. And uh, like I said, we had a great, great time. So guys, I really hope that you enjoyed um, everything that you just saw. Um, if you want to see more of me, go to thecollectorshut.com. I posted a ton of pitches of celebration. Um, just click on the event coverage um, little page and uh, it'll all pop up. So make sure you go check that out at thecollectorshut.com. You can find me on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, right here on YouTube. Please subscribe, comment, and share. I love hearing from you guys. The support is amazing. And keep tuning in because I have so much more to share with you guys. Like always, may the force be with you. Thanks a million and I'll see you on the next one. See you later.